everyone and welcome to my channel or welcome back if you've been here before. My name is Charmaine and I like to unbox subscription boxes, talk about books, and generally just have a good time. So if you're in for any of that, please consider subscribing. And today we're doing my June things that I'm going to use for my turn and burn. I think other people say that better than I do. <laughs> my turn and burn items for June. That's a little better. <laughs> Okay, I have a giant bowl here full. I did so good last month. You guys would have just saw the video because it would have just come up yesterday. Also, side note, happy birthday for, to my best friend, Caitlin. Woohoo! Um, yeah, so today is June 1st. I am showing this on June 1st because I'm being very serious about this this month. Oh, I got so much cool stuff to show you guys. Okay, um, I'm going to take it out of the bin first so I don't break the bin because it's very heavy. <laughs> How's your guys' day going today? How was your month of May? Did that go fast or what? Okay, I'm gonna bend over here and set the bowl down without breaking it, good job. Okay, yeah, so I have a lot of hair stuff in this one. We're gonna start with that. So first off, I have the BB Curl Moisturizing Shampoo and the BB Curl 3-in-1 Conditioner. I got this, I got a special edition glossy box, box that was the BB and it was all for curly hair. So I have actually another product in here from them as well. This is the Defining Curl Cream, Defining Cream. So it had three um, mini sizes or like sample sizes and then the full size shampoo and conditioner. And because I just finished my shampoo and conditioner, I'm super excited to get into this. And oh yeah, I didn't even smell it before. Oh, it smells really good. It's kind of like light and fresh and a little bit citrusy. Oh yeah, that's gonna be nice. Okay, my um, I had the Arden Co ones before and they were kind of spicy. So I'm excited to try something different. And this is a good size, like that's 8.5 fluid ounces. I think that lasts like three months for me. Because honestly, I don't shampoo my hair every single time I wash my hair because I have curly hair, you're not supposed to do that. Like it dries your hair out really bad. I mean, like anybody's not supposed to do that. But the next thing I have here is the thing that's almost done. This is the Caviar Anti-Aging Moisturizing CC Cream. It's a 10-in-1 complete conditioning leave-in. Like it's almost done. You guys can tell it's like pretty squished out. So I'm excited to use this and get it done. I got this in my FabFitFun box and I'm also gonna use my pattern thing here. I think I have like this much left in here. So <laughs> I wanna use that up. Look at how huge it is. Like this was amazing. Also, it said that it had patchouli in it. So I thought that it was like, cause patchouli and I are not friends. Like, I don't like that smell, but um, I thought it was going to be like really, really smelly like that, but it kind of smells like lavender actually. So it's fun. So yeah, I maybe have like one use left in here, maybe, maybe two, but I feel as though it's like that high above the things. So it's going to be done soon. Those are my hair things. Then I started a new mascara, which is the Milk Makeup Mascara here. And I will show you guys the one because I used it today. Very fancy. <laughs> This is what it looks like here. And I will tell you from the ones that I used in my last video, like my um, turn and burn uses compared to this one, I like this one much better. The other ones kind of went like up and then in like an hourglass kind of shape. And this one's more of a poof. So I like the poof size better. However, I would not know that without opening up a mascara. So I'll never know if it's gonna be the one that I like or not. But this is waterproof mascara. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, and it's by Milk Makeup. And I think Milk Makeup is vegan and cruelty free. I think so. Then we have the Pure Heels Real Rose Petal Sleeping Mask. I've used this like, I want to say like 10 times. I probably used it like every other day to begin with. And then I kind of did it every third day before I went to sleep. You guys can see like, it doesn't look like I used a whole lot. Like there's not very much out of there. But the first time I used it, I was like globbing it on and it was way, way too much. I didn't realize that it was like not a mask that you're going to wash off. So you shouldn't put like a whole bunch on. It's more like a moisturizer. It smells like real rose petals. It does have one of these little things and it did come with like a little scoop so you can get it out. Let me see. Whoops. <laughs> I dropped the thing face first down. But yeah, so you can tell that I use some. Hopefully you guys can see it there because I can't tilt it too much because it is kind of liquidy. It smells so good though. It smells like crushed rose petals. Oh my gosh, it's so good. So yeah, I've really been enjoying that and my skin does feel moisturized in the morning. So I think it's doing what it's supposed to be doing overnight. 
but don't put on a whole giant amount like you're doing like a face mask because that's not it's not the same thing that's not the same thing which I learned then I have a hand cream here that is the citrus and grapefruit BASD refreshing body lotion because I just finished mine so I figured I would have another little one that could sit beside my uh, my couch I have like a little spot where I keep like hand lotion and stuff like that so I figured that's a good size and grapefruit is like a food scent so I don't think that this will bother my scent sensitives then I have all of these masks <laughs> I was so excited I did so good on masks somebody had told me they're like you don't have just have to use masks on Monday and then I was like whoa I don't so then I started using them like all the time before work after work when I wasn't feeling good if I had like a bad day I would go and put a mask on like oh, so nice so nice okay so first we're gonna go through the eye masks I have three of the Wander Beauty baggage claim gold eye masks I probably have too much here but I don't know then I have a Grace and Stella everything's better in pink jelly mask then I have the Rodeo Dragon's Blood eye masks I haven't tried these before but Cece from Cece's Child Size Life you guys know her she's like my friend she uh, like loves these when she got them in her um glossy box because we both got them in glossy box she was like really really excited so I'm excited to try these dragon's blood eye mask like they just sound fancy Ooh, maybe I'll read I'll read like a good book while I'm wearing these that'll be a good one then I have the 111 skin rose gold illuminating eye masks so I also have the 111 skin rose gold brightening facial treatment mask I'm gonna do like a double double mask like I'll do the eye masks with this mask is that a good idea people who have used these please let me know because everybody told me how amazing this mask was and then I was like maybe I'll never use it and I'll just hold on to it but we're not about that life we're not about that life anymore we're using the good stuff so yeah so I want to know if it's good like this one I heard was good but should I use it with this or should I use it separate like should I treat myself to these and then treat myself to this after or should I like do this on different days or like do this one in the morning before work and then this one after let me know in the comments I'm really really excited about these you guys could tell because I talked about it for like a whole two minutes <laughs> then we have the suns out pouts out gold foil lip mask looks like this I got this from a bit fun it's a good one I put it on and then my boyfriend's happy because I can't talk for those 10 minutes that's a joke for him because he watches these just so you guys know like I'm not bugging him like I am I'm bugging him I'm teasing him but it's okay then we have the uh Zen May I think is how you say it one that I got from Tanya this is uh it looks like it's a gold foil one and I think maybe it's honey because if you look at the packaging it has like a honeycomb pattern so that's nice and she put a little thank you sticker on there she gave me that when I bought some stuff from her which were these so I got the super beauty 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 uh honey Jarrett rose mask which I'm excited about it also smells like crushed roses I did not realize how much I like the scent of rose I'm not really like I don't really like flowers that much like cut flowers like to bring home and kind of thing so I didn't really realize how much but then I started using this and I was like oh it smells good and then I tried this one night after work and I was like oh my gosh like so yeah I kind of really like that smell then I have the last two masks here are the I am broccoli vitality by Tony Moly this is my first ever Tony Moly mask I don't want to be that dork but I might keep the packaging <laughs> like, I might put it in like my collection of like you cool YouTube stuff that I keep where I keep like everybody's names when I pull their like who won the giveaway and stuff like that which reminds me I have a giveaway that I have to pull whoa it was a secret yeah it's over it's fine yeah so I have that one and then the last one is the creme shop turmeric and matcha one so I used the kombucha and watermelon one that came with this amazing like I used it today before I filmed actually so you guys will see that in my upcoming mass Monday and it was so good it smelled so good that is not a nice video though I'm very cranky in that video but you guys will see why yeah so this will be filming after that so you'll have already seen it anyways yes that's what I'm gonna use what are you guys using for the month please let me know like for serious about this and like the eye mask one where did I put it where did I put it of course I put them all out of order oh this one like let me know if I should use them together or use them separate or have like a double oops <laughs> a, a double spa day or like do one in the morning and then do one after work 
or do the eye mask first and then do this after like I don't know I don't know let me know because the 111 skin ones are like super super bougie and I'm gonna like sit there and I'm gonna have some tea and I'm gonna read my book while I have them on and just like chill out maybe listen to some Beethoven and relax I don't know I'm very excited uh what do you guys think what do you guys think about the stuff that I picked have you guys ever tried this stuff before if you have curly hair have you ever tried the bumble and bumble stuff before because I'm very excited to use that I don't know okay I'm pumped I'm very looking forward towards this month May was not a great month like just like personally and like outside of like and work and work and stuff like outside of the YouTube fam it was not good but <laughs> I mean it's June now so May is over it can only get better from here <laughs> all right uh please like this video uh check out the other content creators in my description box Thank you guys so much for spending a couple of minutes of your day with me. I really, really appreciate that. And I really, really appreciate you. And I'll see you guys in my next video. I am having so much fun with this channel. I hope you guys are enjoying it as well. I just want to point that out there. I'm not going to get emotional or anything. I do actually quite often get emotional about it though. But yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.